All right, morning everyone, or whenever you find this video. <laughs> okay, so I just wanted to show y'all, this is how I make the holes, is I burn them each individually. And the reason that I use this little torch, and this is the fluid, the butane that I use for it, is because I can control the size of the hole. So I'm not using a universal size of something because then more weeds will come through. The whole reason is uh, to suppress weeds. Also the heat, because in Minnesota here it does not get very warm. So I'm heating the ground up so all this winter squash will have enough time to grow. And the heat it needs to grow. So, but using it each, uh, doing each hole like this. Um, I am doing like spacing with my ruler here. Um, don't always do that. But if you do it this way too, your ruler, you can do things in the spacing that they need. Instead of, I saw a lot of videos before looking at what people did. If I use a more powerful tool than this lighter, um then it just burns the landscape fabric like uh it just starts burning the whole thing <laughs> so I, I don't want that and also if i do some things we're using like a tin can heating up a tin can and just choot, choot, and that is faster i will say for sure um but the spacing is going to be different depending on what you're planting and I didn't want that big a size of a tin can uh, for the hole because I don't need that necessarily. So, um, yeah, I can control the size. I can control the distance, you know, the spacing be between for the plants I'm growing in the landscape fabric. And it doesn't burn through the whole thing when I'm using this. So... If I turn it on, sometimes I got to use the uh, other lighter though to, to, I can't do it. Ah, <laughs> well y'all get the idea, but uh, it's a little hard to do it while I'm videotaping too, but there you go.